Hey, another question here from Anthony. If you rebrand, what happens to your old listing on Google if there was a company name change? We can speak to that a yeah. lot. Yeah, so, so it's funny, for, you know, Anthony, I can speak to this too because after 22 years, I rebranded and renamed our agency, right? So, I mean, it's oh, like one right. of these things there is that if I can do it, like then right. certainly you guys can do it as well. But I rebranded and we had those same concerns. So we had literally 22 years worth of Google history um, before we used to be called graphic designs. That was the name. It was graphic D dash signs. Uh, so we were worried about that as well. Like what's going to happen on the SEO perspective. Mm -hmm. And, and, mm -hmm. and, you know, there's a whole method to doing that. You know, you do all the redirects, every single page gets redirected to your new page. You know, you're going to be able to carry over your Google reviews um, and the rankings will follow as long as you do it properly. I mean, for mm -hmm. us, it was, 18 or 1900 pages that we had to redirect. So it was, it was a pretty extensive process, uh, but we really didn't miss a beat as far as that's, that's concerned. Um, you know, so um, doing that, obviously changing over your social media, letting Facebook know those things are fairly straightforward uh, mm -hmm. to get that stuff to carry over. Yeah, we can. It's a piece of cake. It is a, it is a piece of cake. <laughs> it's, don't, don't let that stop you from rebranding. Well, I mean, it, you got to do the right process. You got to go through the process. Yeah, it's, it's but just it, a thing. But it's, it doesn't mess you up. Oh, no, no. Hmm. You know, and um, it just has to it has to be methodical and you, right. you've got to make sure that you, you know, don't miss anything. But, yeah, and a, and a lot of and, and don't don't get caught with this. Um, uh, I, 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 yes. The thing that the guys I don't want to put a bad. A lot of guys will say, well, my customers know me by this. I'm going to lose all my customers. Mm -hmm. You're not going to lose any customers. Uh, in fact, you're going to wind up gaining so, customers. Don't don't be so blinded by your own whatever. Mm -hmm. And, and that the rollout, there's a methodology to doing that successfully, you know, mm -hmm. notifying the existing customers, right. you know, having them be aware, letting them know what the change is, why we changed, having them feel partly responsible for the change, you know. Mm -hmm. So there's there's a whole thing that we do when we do a brand launch that makes it very seamless. And, and you know, a rebrand is, is obviously a little bit easier than changing the actual name. But even the rebrands, it's important to let the customers know that they're going to start seeing some changes and why those changes transpired. Almost thank them for that, and to have them really feel like a part of that. Um, Being so part of the process, we right? Do right. The communications, yeah, and, and you know, we do usually do direct mail. We do the email marketing, and then we do the social to to have them know the changes they're going to start seeing. Because you know, maybe there's one old truck and one new truck out on the road, and people right. may be you know confused mm -hmm. about that, and letting them know about you know, what's happening with, with that. So um, I'm going to, I'm going to pay something Richard in, in the chat here. That's just um, talking about like what you said about, you know, how powerful the rebrands are and, and what some of those results may be. Th this is the page that I think I'd showed you once before that had some of the stats. Oh yeah. Our concern. So I just want to paste that up there. If anybody wants to check that out, but yeah, guys, be sure to check this out pin that and we'll pin, we'll pin you it know, to the top. You see the ROI. Um, on, on some of these things and, and they're they're just you know it's crazy stuff to see and it's just just awesome to, to feel part of that too to oh, know yeah. how our work is impacting so many lives as far as you know the company's ability to hire more people like you mentioned to recruit more people you know yeah. that's a big thing like oh I can't get anybody to work for you well does it look like I want to work for you, you know? exactly <laughs> that's what I, why would anyone want to work for you right you know? right you know right. So.